Hello everyone, uh, welcome to Recorded Lessons with Priest and Science. Uh, essentially, we have a mission which is to try and deliver the best possible lessons we can, uh, but with you at home and with us at home, which is a little bit of a challenge. Hence, we've turned to what we've called Recorded Lessons. Um, however, we are learning, so there is a warning here. Uh, it's likely that there will be bumps along the way, so bear with us until, until we get it nice and smooth for you. Um, in terms of lesson design, we're going to try and stay absolutely faithful to what we have started uh, to Priest and Science. So every lesson will re begin with retrieval practice. That's to help you not to forget previously learned material. Then we'll move to uh, an instruction phase, which basically is where the teacher will try and teach you something new. Uh, then we'll move to an embed phase. Uh, where we just want you to spend five minutes learning what we've been through in this lesson. And finally, there'll be a practice phase where you'll have a chance to practice what's being taught in the lesson. Uh, in terms of resources, generally you're going to need uh, either a mini whiteboard uh, or a pen and paper. And some revision cards would be useful as well. So getting some of those before each session would be useful and well, actually important. And then you are going to need uh, either the printed resources from Show My Homework uh, or an exercise book and some lined paper. Uh, the third phase, you're going to need pretty much the same as what you used in the first phase. So or somebody to quiz you would be just as good. And finally, again, you're going to either need the stuff from Show My Homework uh, or you're going to need to get yourself um, the exercise book and some lined paper. Uh, in terms of lessons, we're going to publish three to four lessons per week for Key Stage 3 and four to five lessons per week for Key Stage 4. And on the last lesson of each week, we will put a recall test. Now, that recall test will focus on what has been covered that week. So it's essential that you do the lesson properly, learn what's, be, what's been taught, so that when you do the recall test, you can show your teacher uh, what, what's sticking, essentially, what you remember. Our final tip to make sure that this all goes nice and smoothly is to make sure that you are organized and that you have a clear routine. So getting yourself some sort of timetable is going to be really important. Um, so I'm going to leave you now and tell you to get yourself organized, get your resources together, get your timetable sorted out, and we'll see you for that first lesson.